This is day three of going over the major muscles in the body. And today we're gonna to go over the muscles of the eye and the nose. So this muscle right here is the circular muscle surrounding the eye known as the orbicularis oculi. It's a circular muscle that surrounds the eye. And when you uh, contract this muscle, it closes the eye. This muscle right here on the eyelid is known as the levator palpebrae superioris. And it pulls the eyelid back. So it opens up your eyelid and pulls the eyelid back. There's a muscle that's not shown in this model here that runs from the frontal bone up to the skin just above or below the eyebrow. And it is known as the corrugator supercilii. And it pulls the eyebrows down and wrinkles the skin in between the eyebrows. So it furrows your brow there. Then you have a muscle that runs this way that is called the procerus muscle. And the procerus muscle is sort of uh, originates on the frontal bone, inserts on the nasal bone, and it, or skin above the nasal bone, and it pulls the nose up a little bit, and it works in concert with this muscle here known as the nasalis muscle. The nasalis originates on the maxilla, comes over and connects to the fibrous connective tissue over top of the midline of the nose and the nasal bone, and it helps to flare and constrict the nostrils. So we have the nasalis, the procerus, corrugator supercilii, orbicularis oculi, and the levator palpebrae superioris. Follow along for more. Later.